You say on terror, so trash. Oh no. You nearly made me say the the bad word. You say on terror, so trash. Mr. Serres, you clearly have feelings and opinions. I want you to know that I, I respect you and I want to listen to them. So you've got the floor. Come on. Tell me what you tell me what I said about terror. What was bad with it? I love it when people who hate me come in because I know for the next 10 minutes my content is just now sorted. Hell yeah, let's go, dude. See, he knows, dude. That's why I like this guy. Dude, he knows. Whenever someone comes in here, dude, and they say something stupid, in my head I'm like, this is going to be good for the next 10, 15, 20, 30 minutes. This is awesome. That means I don't have to do anything. That's the secret. You want to be a content creator? Here's the first tip. Whenever someone comes in and they're a fucking idiot, you just use it against them. Because one, it makes them look stupid. Two, it's free fucking content, brother. Okay, let's go. Every single minute on stream is always me. What the bollocks? Every moment with <laughs> Wait, what? stream is what the bollocks. I was genuinely not expecting that. This is new. Okay. What the fuck game is this? I don't even know. Oh, Dragon Age 1. Okay, It's okay, always okay, easy okay, to pick okay. out the trolls' messages because they're normally okay. all in caps. I play 11 years. Terra Amazing. That's a long time to play Terra. 11 years. 11 years. You know, I just might believe him. Because I bet on January 25th, he celebrated 11 years. I bet you he's proud to say that. Oof, okay. Okay, I'm just going to scroll down, see where this saga goes to. <laughs> where, where does this saga... You can pause the game. You pause all the Bioware games. You played 11 years. Terror is there. Um, okay. Yep. Yep. A Asmon of Terror is in the chat. I mean, what's... You mean like this? Yes. When you type in chat, Yo, here's the the guy is the Asmund Cole of Terra. Holy shit, dude! Whenever a troll comes in, they always type in all caps, which makes their messages very easy to pick out. Oh hell yeah! Hell I mean, yeah. yeah. If if you enjoyed Terra and you've spent eleven years in there, okay, cool, great. That's nice. Did you have fun? I played um, Neverwinter for like five years. Yeah, he started on Neverwinter. I think it was a New World reaction. He wanted to try to tell people, let people know that he wasn't trying to shit on the game, right? So he was like, man, I started on Neverwinter and I love Neverwinter, but when it became shit, I acknowledged it was shit. I knew it was shit and I stopped playing that shitty fucking game. Even though I love it, it's still shit. I played Neverwinter for a little bit. I had fun. It's a bad game. Yeah. But I had fun. If I say your game is not as good as it could be, I'm not saying that you didn't have fun. I'm not invalidating your experience. And if you watched any of my videos, you would literally hear me say that repeatedly. What he just said, I have to explain on almost a daily fucking basis to people because, dude, people are so personally attached to these games, it's unreal. If I were to say, hey, I think Blood Weapon is fucking stupid, people would actually say, no, you're stupid, Smadge, you're dumb, I hope you die. They would actually say that because you cannot say anything bad about someone's favorite fucking game. Because if you say, but I have fun, Smadging! If you say something bad about someone's favorite game, then that means that you are personally attacking them. But, uh, hey, it's okay. It's okay. If, if we want to keep discussing that kind of stuff, we can keep discussing that kind of stuff. Let's see. What was I wrong right. about it? I'm a WoW player. Yeah, time you enjoyed wasting is not wasted time. If you had fun and you enjoyed it, yeah, that's good. good stuff True. going on right there. I yo, I, yo, I can tell you what, man. He just said time you enjoy wasting is not wasting time. That's 100%. I had an amazing time leveling in Classic Ion. When I leveled in Classic Ion with like Arthurs and Elo and Nova and Ark and Cow, it was fucking awesome, man. It was so fun. Tons of fun. And it was completely fucking wasted because I don't play the game anymore. But I had a blast. I like your vids. But old games speak, look bad, quest bad, yes. But what players can do, no, no thanks. What the Quest fuck bad. did you just say? There's some good stuff going on right there. I like your vids, but old games speak, look bad, quest bad, yes, but what players can do, no, no thanks. Okay, Saras, you're going to have to give me a second because I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm good, but you're just going to have to let me just undecode this. Hang on. Yes, I like your vid, 
we're on the same page so far. I appreciate that. But on old game, as in terror is an old game, okay. Speak, look, bad, quest, bad, yes. But what players can do, no thinks. I completely agree. What you're saying is, yes, the I've, I've is no bad, idea. and yes, the questing system is bad, and yes, everything that isn't combat is bad, but, you know, what can you do? What can you do? Um, you make a video about it saying everything apart from the combat's bad. And then the game company will look at it and go, oh, damn, everything apart from the combat is bad. Maybe we should improve the other stuff. Or you could just... You, you could just not play terror. Like, you could play another game. No, 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 no. You can't just play another game because these people are personally connected to this game. Like me, I'm never going to play another game besides Final Fantasy XIV. You know why? Because I love XIV. Because XIV is comfy. Because I'm too stupid. You know why people play WoW? Because they're molded by it. They're sculpted by it. They're groomed by it. They love it. The WoW devs could do whatever the fuck they want. They could take a big ass shit all over the players. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Still going to play. Still going to play. Still going to play. It doesn't matter. These people have been playing for fucking 10. How long has the game been out? 20 fucking years. It's a part of their life. It's almost like cutting a big chunk out of your life, like a portion, your daily routine and shit. You don't need to only play one game. You can play another one. And then you can come back to Terra later. How? <laughs> See, that's what I mean. It never even occurs to these people. To be fair, Terra was really grindy and it required you to log in almost every single day. So if you're not going to log in every day and you're trying to actually accomplish things, then you might as well quit. It's kind of like Ion. If you're not going to log in every day, then you might as well not play, you know? I mean, Steam... Do you think Terra is the only game in the world? Like, you just... Just download another game. I don't know how detailed I need to go on this. Um, you could just play another game and then return to Terra in the future. I mean, I don't know if you've heard about... Unless you play on the JP server because the JP server got shut down. Ooh. The I played Terra 11 years, her amazing. Okay, so cool. Keep playing Terra while playing another game. I've eaten pizza for many years. I have a burger every now and again. Sometimes even a curry. Who knows? You could just play another game. I feel like this person's mentality, a lot of other people have. People were asking me about Swords of Legends. They were like, should I play this game? Do I want to play this game? Streamer, should I play this game? Do you think this game's going to last longer than a year? And I said, I have no idea. I don't think it's going to last long. This is a filler game for me. However, I'm going to play it because right now I'm having fun. And while I only played Swords of Legends for maybe like a couple months, the fun that I had in that game was very high. And I don't regret playing that game. There's like way too many people man they'll say a game is dead on arrival if it doesn't last like a year or they'll say a game is dead on arrival if it doesn't last two years a lot of people have been asking me about lost ark right me personally i'm not into lost ark like i think it's overhyped i think the game looks kind of like shit to be honest i'm not really into it do i think it's going to last longer than a year no i think it's going to be dead over here because it's a fucking korean game and every korean game is fucking dead over here that's what i think however do i want that to happen no but that's what I think it's going to happen. However, even though I think that, if I still thought that it was going to be fun and that I was interested, I would still play it. Because I knew Classic Ion was going to fucking die, but I still played that. So it doesn't matter how long a game lasts, necessarily, because I value the fun that I have during my playtime. If a game is only going to last me three months, but I'm going to have a lot of fun playing it, then I'm going to play the game. And I'm going to cherish those three months. I'm going to enjoy those three months. I'm going to think back on it. Like when I first played Guild Wars 2, okay? I played Guild Wars 2 for, I don't know, nine months a year, and I had a ton of fun with it. I went back later and played it for about three months. I had a lot of fun with it. I've done the same thing with Terra. I did the same thing with Ion, you know, 12 years later. I had fun. Like, before some people even decide to play a game, fun is not the first thing on their list. How long is the game gonna last is the first thing. And I think that if you have that mentality, I think that you're missing out on a lot of fun. I think you're missing out on a lot of good memories. That's what I think. I fucking love Star Wars. I had some of the best, best PvP 
times in Star Wars. I will never forget, never, never forget. Star Wars was my PvP game. I loved it. Rift was my raid game. That's where I learned to raid. That's where I started to raid. That's where I started to play tank. And the memories that I have in that game, I'll always cherish. And I'm so glad that I was able to play Star Wars. And I'm so glad that I was able to play Rift. Even though I didn't play them longer than, you know, like a year, two years, something like that. Am I still playing Warframe off stream? I mean, not literally right now, but in general, yes. Um, you can play other games. I play Warframe. Okay, cool. So, Sarah, what did you disagree with in my video? What did you watch me say about Terra and think, oh, he's wrong there? What was wrong about my video? What did I categorically say that was wrong? Because, like, if you can tell me exactly what He thinks what I said, Ellen are great. Wrong, I will be able to look into it and apologize for it. So oh, I can't shit. Write, hey, that's fine. Sarah's. I cannot write any other language. Okay? So you, you said the game was dying. Let it go, Josh. RuneScape doesn't love you, Josh. Oh, my God. You do not need to. No one should ever apologize for not speaking a second language very well. Because I guarantee you are already way ahead of most other people. That guy typed out that sentence that made no fucking sense. I wish that I could speak another language half as good as that because I can't even speak English well, let alone another language. <clears throat> it's like if someone says, sorry, I don't speak this second language very well. The fact you speak a second language at all is super impressive. So mm -hmm. never apologize for not being fluent at a, a second language because I'm not fluent at a second language at all. Absolutely not. Terror. Sarah, did you watch the video? Like, did you actually watch the video, genuinely? See, here's the problem. You know how we asked that question twice? Did you watch the video? Did you actually watch the video? It's because, believe it or not, people will click on a YouTube video and they won't watch the video. Would you believe that? Would you believe that? That they click on the video and they don't watch the video? Why are you on, why are you on YouTube then? If you're not there to watch the video. Because if you watched the video, what you will have heard is me explain that I like Terra, I like the combat, and I like the situations you can get into, but I don't like the fact that the choices they have made have killed the game. You need to understand, I didn't kill Terra, because I don't develop Terra. What I have done is reported on what the developer has done. And if you're upset about that, that's not my fault for telling you. I get so much shit for this in Final Fantasy. Look at this shit. Stupid motherfucker, you're basically responsible for killing the way Warrior plays. Well, watch out, motherfucker, because I'm coming for other jobs, too. If I ruin Warrior, I'm going to ruin them all. Next up on my list is fucking Dark Knight. So you better not be a Dark Knight main. It's the developer's fault for doing it. Don't get sad or angry or annoyed at the person who tells you what's happening you need to get sad and annoyed at the people who make the decisions now in this case yes i did go into the terror office and press the big make shit button <laughs> it was really good up until i did that so my bad on that one okay totally understand for anyone concerned that that was a that's sarcastic i didn't actually do that okay <laughs> So, no, don't get annoyed at me telling you the way things are. Get annoyed at so he admits the way it. things are. Sorry, and for me, I like with the game. Yeah. Okay, I like the game as well. Do you not understand that we both like the game? Do you think me releasing that video killed Terra? Do you think my video Ooh. damaged Terra? I do. Do you Shouldn't think really me see. telling people how the game is okay sarah's how how did my video well see here's the trick whenever there's something bad in a video game you don't you don't talk about it because you don't want to spread it because then if other people know then they'll tell their friends and then their friends won't play the game that they want to play and you just ignore all the bad shit and you just pray and you hope and they're going to come out with good shit there's going to be three ultimates this expansion there's going to be three ultimates this expansion there's going to be three ultimates this expansion video damage terror what did I do that hurt Terra? Because if your only answer is, I showed people the game, what does that tell you about the game? <laughs> if you think I can damage a game by showing people the game, <laughs> 
maybe the problem is the game. It just seems very strange. A lot of people do jump on and defend their game. If I make a bad video on it, they jump on and defend their game. He's right. You are so they do it amazing all the time. to show problem. Thank you. I am amazing. That's true. <laughs> I, everything I do is perfect. I'm aware of this. Okay, so I'm sorry that Terra died in 2014. So, okay. Like, I wasn't doing anything in 2014. How are you blaming me for killing a game back in 2014 when I wasn't doing anything? In fact, no, I'm pretty sure back in 2014 I made the should you play Terra video and the answer was yes. Like, you know, Terra back in the day was lit, was so fucking good. And then, you know, the fate of every Korean MMO that ever comes over here fucking ruined. I killed the game that died. <clears throat> I, I'm going to be real, guys. I did not know I had this kind of power. Although, to be fair, Absolutely. I played Defiance 2050, then that shut down, then I played Life is Feudal, then that shut down, then I played... Because of Josh, I'm never going to play New World, 100%. I'm never going to play New World. I'm going to watch him play it, him suffer through it, and make a video, and then I'm going to laugh at his video. That's what I'm going to do. Second Hand Lands, then that shut down, then I played Terra, and apparently I've killed it. Uh, Mortal Online 1, that's going to be shutting down soon. Um, yeah, I... Josh does play 14, I'm pretty sure. The Grim Reaper going into various I don't know how hardcore doors. he plays or anything, but... It's just, that's me, and every previous door is a game that I've played. I'm very sorry. That, goodbye, New World. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Can dude. you imagine? Can oh, you yeah. imagine if New World dies, the amount of people that are going to come and attack me with stuff? Oh, yeah, dude. Yo, you're fucked. New World's done, though. Like this.